I'm Melissa Taylor. I run Tailored Communication, which is a publicity agency based in Berlin. I was promoting in England for eight years or something before I moved here. I was working at an agency with really big artists. They had lots of number one hits. Craig David, Kylie Minogue, like, and big pop battles. The only thing I left that knowing was that I never, ever, ever wanted to do it again. I never wanted to work with pop princesses, work on things where the music doesn't matter, it's all about the hype or someone showing their bottom or something. I moved to Berlin to start my business because there was a gap in the market, not here, but in general, also in the UK, because um, all the agencies were very expensive and only covered very small areas. And so my idea was to do lots of digital promo. I'm sorry, it's my fault. Um, and to offer it worldwide, because that's what I'd been doing at Fabric. So that was it. I came here and somehow it worked. <laughs> Journalists are the same the world over. <laughs> they, they like what they like and they, they either respond to your approach or they don't. I have quite a specific way of dealing with people. I don't try and force people to like things. I don't tell journalists what to think. All we can do is get the best music that we can and then give it to them in the simplest way possible and hope that they like it. The press has a reputation of being annoying, like a dark art that you know only really annoying women go into or something, um, and I don't think that's true. I think it very much depends on how you put yourself across, and the music as well. There's people who are working for agencies who are having to force people to listen to stuff because they don't like it themselves, and there's plenty of agencies who are just doing stuff for money, so they have to take a different approach. I've never, I've never gone looking for business. Every, every client we have, apart from one, came to us. Everyone's come through word of mouth and being recommended by their friends, you know? And so we've ended up with a network of people who are all kind of interconnected and and that we have relationships with on all different levels. And that's really nice on a Monday morning to know that you're actually getting up and working for yourself and for your friends.